Hey guys, so we're here today for a Stormtrooper slash Clone Trooper slash everything in between Lego review. So let's Number get started. one, we have the regular Clone Trooper. So this is him in his phase one armor with the standard DC-15 blaster pistol. Number two, we have our standard clone pilot, which was mostly used in the Revenge of the Sith, but was different in the Clone Wars. He's holding a regular pistol in case of any emergency. Next, we have Clone Commander Gree. He is wearing his Kashyyyk armor and was seen in Revenge of the Sith. And this is his phase two form. Now we have the standard Clone Trooper unmasked, wearing this buzz cut. Uh, a pr wearing also wearing the backpack that he uses. So this is quite a special. Next we have a Genosius Parada Trooper. These are special ops troopers, and they u they were used. And this is his uh, his Genosius armor. This is the Genosius Trooper Parada Trooper unmasked. As you see, he has the same gun, and he has. Kind of a sloppy haircut, but yes. Now we have a standard Imperial Stormtrooper. Now we have a Scout Trooper holding a DC-17 sniper rifle, and that he is indeed a specialist, and that's what he uses. Next we have the standard Imperial Officer used in command centers, including the Death Star, and these guys are not generally used on Imperial Star Destroyers, but also the type that are used for that. Now we have the Imperial Officer used on, on Star Destroyers, so you could say he's an Imperial Navy Officer. This is an Imperial Bomber, and he was seen in the Solo A Star Wars movie. Next we have the Imperial Sand Troop. Sand Trooper, first seen in Star Wars A New Hope. Finally, we have a First Order Snow Trooper. Please visit our channel CAV for more amazing videos and subscribe for even more.